So we're just sailing currently for some last fish. We've got some customers on site today. The look through and the maggots are here. They've all, there we go, look at that, loads of them. We're making some good progress now. So we've got the, down to the last 20 centimetres. We got down to a, a good metre and then we need another 20 centimetres just to clear the bottom and I think they're basically done. So you can see they've got the level there. Can you see there, that's that level. They've got this small bit, it's probably about 10 centimetres or just a, a sort of a, they call their fulkers, a, a hose depth. And then I think will be enough depth here. Pond Rosie, we're not quite finished. We started draining it yesterday. You can see the sacks are showing and then we'll finish this off in a couple of days. But some good progress. It's been very wet, so you can see the mud, just how wet it is. It uh, doesn't smell great. I think this is former swamp, so it's why it's so black. Um, yeah, I've got to show you some feeding. I haven't done that in a while. So this is our four millimeter feed. Let me show you what we're using. And uh, the fish are really enjoying it currently. We've got two ponds left. We've got fish in this one, and then fish in this one. But we've got maybe four and a half in here, a thousand, four and a half in here, which is too many, we've overstocked. You learn things every day, right? Um, but we'll start selling these in the next few weeks, These some of these fish, so quite exciting. We're just sailing currently for some last fish. We've got some customers on site today. There's not many fish left in here, but we've got enough that we can sell some. So I think in the next couple of days, this will be empty. You can see how much easier it is to sane when there's not much water in the in the pond. It's just pulled this out. This is a mudfish, which would have come in from the pipe because it's a wild stream. You can see what they look like. Okay. This, people actually eat these. From, they catch them from the swamp in traps, but they go up to about 50 grams. They get smoked. But, uh, they are they can survive quite a long time out, outside of water. That's why mm. they're called mudfish. And then these are the fish that we're going to eat. An issue with the happers that we've ordered, they're all scattered around. They hadn't come with this feeding ring, this is a feeding ring that goes around the side of the net around here and then it stops the feed from floating away when you feed the, you feed the fish inside the happer and they hadn't put that on so this gentleman's come down all the way from Kampala to help us. Samuel here who works for us is um, learning the tricks of the trade and how to add feeding feeding rings to these happers. So those are the ones we've done. It's a bit of a, a lot of work, but it would allow us then to have everything in order. So when we start our trial, we're feeding the fish. We can be sure, as much, sure as we can, the, the feed that floats isn't getting washed out of the, the happer with all the fish in. So I think there's only about a third of them. They've got quite a bit to go still see the progress we've built a couple more bays which we're getting finished off just had a look through and the maggots are here they've all there we go look at that loads of them um so that's pretty good happy enough with that i'm just gonna sorry Ruth. let's come down here have a look at the the other bays how they're doing so we've ex you can see we've extended them slightly so they're slightly longer, just so we can make sure we've got that optimum height that we need. And uh, yeah, it's going to be great. We'll have staggered production. So of course we need maggots every day. So if we do it this way, we can have the supply of maggots we need because you have maybe three to five days of maggots from each bay. And multiply that up by the six bays that we have. We've got space and then... Even if we need to extend more, we've still got more space. We've got this whole bar there, so it's looking good.